since the mid-70s, Monash University has run the Glass Studio and is actually the oldest teaching and learning Glass Studio in, in Australia. We offer uh, Glass as a major through the Bachelor of Visual Art and Bachelor of Fine Art. Kira Galleries, director Peter Cullina, has played a significant role in supporting the Monash Glass Studio. We sh give them a show every year, the Monash Momentum. We, hold, we give prizes at the end of each year. We involve each other, ourselves with glass artists. Since 2007, uh, I've been involved in the Monash Momentum exhibition, which showcases current students, staff, alumni, and uh, is a great exhibition for, for promoting Monash University. Everyone was very excited when they heard that Nick Mount was coming. What we're going to do is, first, I'll blow a decanter, because that's what I normally do when I start a session, just to feel the glass out and have a look what's, what's there. The plan the I make a on the day top, with the people, and, the and uh, I translate myself into their position. Now, I really enjoy getting involved in all of that. The students, you know, quite often haven't seen the way that I work and um, I, I really uh, try hard to work in a way that makes it exciting, that gets people's um, passion going for the material. The students love his work and admire it greatly and he's, he's such a skilled glassblower and technician and, and a lot of fun to, to watch. Glass can often be associated more with decorative art rather than um, contemporary art. Uh, sometimes it, because it can be a functional art, so glass blown vessels and things like that, uh, it can be placed more in the craft realm rather than the art realm. But here at Monash, because it is part of Faculty of Art and Design, we do encourage it to be more in the art realm. And don't regard artists as any different to dentists. It's a very logical way of making a living. It's a small business. And you go about developing your skills and applying those skills to the marketplace. <laughs>